Hey guys, so where we are today is The Hole. So The Hole is located on the Brooklyn Queens border in New York City. And The Hole basically is a neighborhood that is just completely disinvested, right? So you're gonna see abandoned cars, you're gonna see buildings sinking into the earth. It has a lot of crime and you're gonna see a lot of weird things around here. So let's head in. The Hole is a neighborhood on the outskirts of New York City on the Brooklyn Queens border. The low-lying neighborhood is roughly one mile away from JFK International Airport and is one of New York City's dirty little secrets that it doesn't want anyone knowing about. The whole, as the small five-block area is officially and suitingly called, looks like something out of a post-apocalyptic sci-fi film. The vast majority of New Yorkers don't even know this area exists since it is so well hidden in a small forgotten pocket on the Brooklyn Queens border. Interestingly, though the area looks quiet, there is actually a decent population of people living within the abandoned vehicles, trailers, and derelict buildings. These people are known as squatters and are people that live on a property or in an area, but that do not own or rent the space. While filming this video, there were dozens of squatters looking at me wondering why I was in their neighborhood. The area is literally a hole, as it is 30 feet lower than the surrounding area. This creates vast flooding, many streets of which one cannot drive down and you would have to kayak down instead. The area is filled with vermin and stray animals and is notorious for being the home of some of the most polluted water, air, and ground in New York City. Now, the reason you see all this flooding is because the neighborhood is actually 30 feet lower than the surrounding neighborhood. So whenever it rains, whenever there's any kind of moisture, and if there's a bad flood, the area gets completely inundated with water. So what that does is it creates a problem where many of the homes around here are either abandoned or there are still poor people living in them and they're actually sinking into the earth. So it's a big issue for city planning around here. The homes in the area are not connected to the city's sewage system, as this requires gravity to function properly, so many of the buildings lack basic indoor plumbing. Cesspools and septic tanks are used instead. Now one weird thing to note is that the area was actually an infamous body dumping ground for the mob in the 70s, 80s, and 90s, so the FBI actually found several bodies in this area and in particularly empty lots around here because it's so desolate it's so creepy back here and no one ever comes back here it's pretty disinvested i mean cops don't even come in here right so this is the perfect place to dump bodies so in some of these lots right next to us it's all abandoned there's likely more bodies in here that haven't been found yet and what's interesting about that is people actually say that they see spirits of the dead walking around here at night when no one's around. Most of the streets are unpaved and are simply dirt pathways, usually inundated like a river. Freakishly, area residents also seem to suggest that the hole is filled with fugitives, as it is one of the easiest places to hide. There are people who have been living in makeshift homes in the hole for decades.
okay guys that was the hole so it's a small neighborhood but you can see it's horribly disinvested and there's actually a lot of people living in there so like living within those holes and those trailers and those abandoned cars those are people's homes um listen guys if you like this kind of content make sure you subscribe share this video like this video let me know what you think of the hole in the comments below okay guys until next time take care